Alright, so during that pause, I may or may not have checked game facts. Uh, apparently it's in this castle, just at a high point. I thought I had gone to the high point. The game apparently says otherwise. I don't like having to consult game facts or whatever. I like trying to find things myself. And if I wasn't on camera, I would have found it myself. I would have just kept going until I found it. However, I don't want three episodes worth of me just fooling around and not finding it. So, I cheated. Ah, yeah, I consider it cheating. So, that's a high point. Is there a higher point? There must be. So we go up here. Up here, very careful. Ah, aha, okay. How do I get up there? Do I go over here? And then up here? Okay. Honestly, I may or may not have found that on my own. Okay, so I've got the grimoire. The good thing is, I believe I can take the shortcut back. Oh wait, no, because I'm doing another quest while I'm around here. Then what I'm going to do... So I'm going to save. Yes, yes, yes. It holds many twists and turns. I know. I'm falling off of most of them as we speak. I'm going to save, because I got the freaking grimoire. And I'm going to continue on towards the goblin one. Because I don't want to have to walk all the way back here to do that. If that turns out to kill me, eh, cool. At least I did this quest. I, between all the breaks and everything, lost track of time. I don't know how long this episode has been yet. I think I took a break fairly recently, though, so I don't think this one's been too long. So I'll wait a bit before I do an actual, you know, episode break. This is probably... No, this is fairly safe, it looks. I'm going to swap my active quest to... Fortress Besieged, which should have me go north and a little east from here. Uh, west. Totally got my directions right. I meant west, I said east. Happens too often. Oh, oh, sweet, not even any damage. Okay, traveling on, it's going to be nighttime shortly, which is going to be really unfortunate and dark. These guys, these guys aren't bad. One or two of these guys, I can take out. What do you have to say? Oh. <laughs> Prepare as many curatives as possible. Well, I already used all those, so no. I will not be having any curatives. Sweet, you're frozen. Freezing these guys is so much fun. Freezing anyone's fun. These guys just get frozen easier. And propelled into the air easier. Tally-ho. Forward we go. <clears throat> oh, there's some stars. I hope those are stars and not, you know, death. It's kind of hard to tell in this game. Everything could be death. Stay alert. Thanks, pawns. Oh, there's more enemies? Where? You said their name, but I don't see them. They're probably about to stab me, right? No. I don't see any enemies, so screw you guys for trying to fool me. Let's go this way. You know, actually, I'm going to try and stay on the path. The path is safer. To call it safe would be a lie. To call it safer, that's that's more akin to the truth. Hey look, goblins. Something easy to kill. It's beautiful. Oh, it's a goblin with a shield. So less easy to kill. Do I really have to go around the back? Nope. I would have to go around the back of them, probably. Oh, it's a goblin leader. Alright, well, you can die too. That's fine. I got a guy picking up all the items, which is nice. I prefer them to help in battle. But, I like not having to worry about picking up stuff either. Did you drop an item? No. There's another guy. Yes. Oh, there's a few of them. Let's drop one of these. Don't kill me. Ha ha! And, yeah, it's hard to top that fire wall there. How about we just do this? It's a fiery cannon of death and homing attacks. Attacks that are homing in on things besides my intended targets, because... Just because. That's why. Ah, sweet. Rift crystals. Yes, I know. Am I going on a path that'll lead me anywhere where I need to go? I think it curves north over here. If it doesn't, I'm going to have to leave the path. 
nice starry sky. Kind of a an obvious gradient to it. But eh, whatever. If they if they saved budget on this game by not making the most beautiful skybox I've ever seen, I'm fine with that. The gameplay more than makes up for any subpar graphics. And it's not that they're bad. To call this game ugly would not be true. To call it the most graphically advanced piece of software we've ever seen would also be a lie. Huh. That's a harder split. Nope. Take the right one. To the right we go. It's rather dark. Ah, a goblin. I can homing attack him now. Hopefully. Seems to miss him a lot. I imagine the higher ranks of this work much better. Because when I saw my friend play, it worked really well. But he, he was also very high level and fighting pretty much endgame stuff. I'm also gonna equip a lantern. You know, being able to see. Haha! -ha. Sweet. Oh no, it's a goblin with a little bit of armor. I don't know if I'm gonna live. Thankfully, after all the difficult fights I've had, these guys are cake. Like, a few goblins, they just, they fall over. You know what, I'm gonna stab you in the foot. Apparently it missed. I don't know how. That one didn't. Well, apparently you can't kill me, but you can kill all my people very effectively. Come on, yellow, don't you fail me. Sweet. Hiya! That hit, but for chump change worth of damage. I might need a better weapon. That might be my issue. I spent a lot of money on the the shield. Cause I use that a lot. Oh damn it. Why are you dying to goblins? Probably because they have the effective max HP of a worm right now, after all the deaths earlier. But still, goblins? You're better than that. You should be. However, I also should be more accurate than that, so I don't know who, who I should be talking about. Hey, look. None of my attacks stagger. Took three hits, two of which with a element that they are weak against, to start staggering them. That's silly. Yet a one hit to me staggers. Who grows frenzied? There's nothing left. We killed them all. You're going crazy. I keep getting these black iron pieces. I hope those are useful. Be wary of anyone we encounter. Trust no one. Really? I was thinking we should give handshakes and throw parties for everyone we meet. <sighs> I should... Oh, okay. Oh, oh, those are big. Those are big. That killed most of my people. But well, now it should be clear, right? So there you go. There's rocks that come this way. I think I've always gone the way with the Chimera. So I never really found that out. I just had to fight a Chimera. I'm going to veer off the path and take the direct route. Hopefully not filled with death. <laughs> and if it is, well... Well, whatever. Devil Fire Grove. That sounds like a safe place, right? I mean... Whenever I enter Devil... Where's my blue per... Oh, they're right there. Okay, they were so close I couldn't tell where they were. Oh, uh, crap. Slay enemies. Uh, uh, uh. So... That's a... That's a dragon! Not only is it a dragon, that that may be the dragon. I didn't get a good look at him. I am leaving. I, I, I'm going to make it... Oh, that's a trap. Oh, oh, I knew in this area there were sometimes dragons, but... Or, like, drakes, but... This close? Oh, that's... That's bad. There's also... If I go, uh, I'm actually going to backtrack, because there is a camp back that way, with a stone where I'll be able to resurrect my people, uh, and rest, hopefully, if Dragon doesn't completely decimate it. Really? Where is it? 
Uh, I'll also, it, it leads to a shortcut between places, between the, the capital and here. Not the shortest of shortcuts, nor the safest, but a shortcut. So I'm going to try and get to that place. Because with a dragon around, I'm just going to die. So I'm going to try and hit there first. Oh, I think it's on the other side of this pond. Yes, you were careless. And now you're going to die. I'm going to try and get... Nope. Screw them. I can just hire people again. I'll do it off camera, I'll hire them my level so that they're not using all my rift crystals, because they're already gone. Oh, all pain, all suffering. Yes, I know your consciousness fades. Ah, oh, there's the fire, I can see the camp. Come on, camp. Quest fail, don't care. I was not going to be taken down that dragon. No matter the most powerful I've been in this game, which, mind you, probably only about five or six levels above where I am now. Uh, I couldn't even scratch that guy when I found him the other time. So what do you got here? Do you have rest? I can do that. I believe he can do skills too. I think that might be the end of this episode. Uh, let me see. Yeah, it's just me and her now. This should get my regular pawn back. Does not, however, bring back my third one, the healer. Who was the better he Ooh, hiccups. Who was the better healer, my duke? So I think I'm gonna see if I can get new skills. And then probably cut this episode. Eh, don't care about that one. Pull in enemies, that could be interesting. Eh, I don't care about that one. <coughs> I can get more spells, which I'll probably not use. A better fire counter, that's tempting. Chant the weapon of both the user and any nearby pawns with fire. Oh, so I can enchant weapons now. That's cool, I guess. Focuses holy power for a brawn magical shield, persists for longer. I don't use that ability, but I do use the fire counter, so I might do that if I don't find anything else better. Have stamina consumed for blocking. Yeah, a better flame counter. And I think. Let's check my pawn. Don't care about that one. Wow, really? Like nothing? Ah, new. No, that'll never work. Turns things to stone would be great if it had any chance of working. So really nothing. I should auto-equip my ability. Shield, yes. Alright, well. So that was this episode. Uh, Death Befalls. I'm going to save it here and I'm going to pick up another time. Uh, thank you for tuning in. Thanks for watching. I hope you haven't minded me just running around doing crazy stuff these past few episodes. That's kind of what this game is about. It's. I like that aspect. I like the open world without being overwhelmingly open, kind of like Skyrim. Don't get me wrong, I like Skyrim, but the world is almost too open. This at least has a structure and a path to it, which I enjoy. But thanks for tuning in, thanks for watching, and next time, now that I'm all rested, next time I am going to just head straight to that goblin den. Or maybe, now that I'm well rested and I've saved, maybe next time I'll try the dragon, just to show people what it's like.